Hi, I'm Scott, the bug guy. And I'm Seymour Green, the official spokes frog for Alpha Ecological. Today, we're going to answer some questions about some amazing little creatures called ants. Sadie, age six, sent us an email asking a great question about ants. Seymour, why do ants live in ant hills? It's estimated that there are 10,000 or more species of ants in the world. Ants may not always live in hills, but they do always live in large groups called colonies. Some insects only take care of themselves, while others live in special groups called colonies. By living in a colony, ants can divide up all the work needed for the colony's survival. There are four main jobs in an ant hill. There's the queen. She's responsible for laying lots and lots of eggs. They're the males. Whose main job it is to mate with the queen. Hey baby, how you doing? Worker or soldier ants are all sterile females, and they're responsible for gathering the food, building and maintaining the nest, and defending the group. Some ant colonies have millions of members at once. Their clearly defined jobs have helped them survive and succeed. Here's another ant question from Rome, age nine. Seymour, how strong are ants? An ant can lift 20 to 30 times the weight of its own body. That's like the equivalent of a person picking up a car. It's time to hit the gym. I'm going to lift some weights. Has anybody seen the dumbbell? Has anybody seen the dumbbell? Hey, I know what you're doing. That's not funny. At Alpha, it's our job to keep insects in their homes and to remove them if they get into yours. Here are a couple tips to help keep those pesky ants out of your house. Number one. Don't leave food or water around your house. Ants are always looking for a snack. Number two. Plug up any holes or cracks where ants may enter your home. And number three. Don't invite your uncle to come visit. He'll usually bring your ant with him. Get it? <laughs> uncle? Ant? Ah, comedy gold. You're looking at the world's funniest cockroach right here. <laughs> well, that's it for today. But if you have a bug question you'd like answered, send us an email to Seymour at safefrog.com and we may make a video to answer your question. See you later.